Hey, this is Chris, and today I want to talk to you about adding keywords in the description of your YouTube video and the difference it makes. So here is a video review I done. It was actually made for as just a test or an example, and it's kind of funny because I've already made a sell from it uh, because it's ranked. You can see here it's ranked number one on YouTube for all these keywords. Now what I want to talk about is how it got ranked for all these other keywords because if you notice in the title the only keywords that are in it is smarter, vitamins, caffeine, and review. And so if you come down here you're going to see the L-theanine's not in there, Amazon's not in there, and neither is MCT oil or ingredients. And so what a lot of people don't understand especially when you're targeting keywords that don't have a lot of competition is that by adding other keywords in your video description you can easily rank for those keywords also so you can see here in my title what I have and then in my description I have my main keyword because that's what I want to rank for most of all but then in my description I also added this part here I added the L-theanine I also added MCT oil you just kind of kind of mix it in within your sentences throughout your description and then if you scroll on down here you're going to notice that I mentioned um, some of these words a few other times uh, where did I, where'd I just go here here we go that's okay let's go MCT oil right here L-theanine again and if we scroll on down you can see where I have buy smarter vitamins on Amazon you can see down here that that's one of the keywords, Smarter Vitamins, Caffeine, Amazon. It's ranked number one. And uh, over here, in, in the last couple of sentences, what I done was is I just broke up and wrote a couple of sentences just using a few of these keywords. So, so buy Smarter Vitamins, Caffeine on Amazon. And then um, I added MCT oil again, L-theanine again and then in this smarter vitamins caffeine review so I put my keyword here again you'll learn more about smarter vitamins ingredients so if you come down here you'll notice that it's ranked number one for this term and I also put down here where you can buy smarter vitamins caffeine so if you look down here you'll see where it says where to buy smarter vitamins caffeine it's ranked number one for that one and so what you want to do is just mix in these keywords. Now you got to remember if you're targeting a very competitive keyword then most likely your video is not going to rank number one for these extra keywords you're adding throughout your description. But if you're if you're focusing on a keyword, for example this product here, if you just search for like smarter vitamins I think it gets around 200 searches a month. Uh, that's just an estimation. But if you search for smarter vitamins caffeine review I think it's only about 20 but when you add all those searches together with the different variations people are searching you're looking anywhere for probably about 200 to 300 searches a month just estimated which isn't a lot and it's not a very competitive keyword which are the ones that I try to focus mostly on because they rank so easy and they especially rank easy when you mix in other keywords with it like this that's going to allow it to rank for all these other variations of the keyword which is going to result instead of your video getting 200 to 300 views a month it's probably going to get anywhere from 300 to 500 views a month because you got all these other keywords now people searching and finding your video for also so keep that in mind don't neglect the products just because you use a uh, keyword tool and it says it doesn't get very much search volume if it gets 20, 30, 50 searches a month, then that means people are searching for that product. It also means most other affiliates are not even bothering with promoting that product because they don't want to waste their time with it, which is great for me because I can snack, snatch up this product, have it ranked usually within one or two days for all these keywords and start making sales with it. So that's just a tip of the day on how to use keywords in the description of your YouTube video. Hope you guys found it useful. If you did, please subscribe to my channel and also check out the other links under this video. I have some resources under there if you're into video marketing and YouTube that you may find interesting. And if you want to learn how I rank my videos at the top of YouTube, check out my latest course at ytsupremacy.com guys it's 13 bucks for that course to learn how to build an authority YouTube channel to learn how to get your videos ranked at the top of YouTube and even in Google so thanks again have a great day